standing at the corner of Kassau and Blue Mound Road, Waukesha, Wisconsin, brings us to Menards. Welcome to today's video as a recording of this Thursday, August 29th, 2024. We got a haunt of somebody, someone waving. We're at Menards, checking out everything they have to offer for 2024 Halloween. Kind of ironic, yesterday, we were right across the street at Home Depot looking at all their new animatronics. Come and join me and find out what the difference is between the big box stores such as Home Depot, Lowe's, Spirit Halloween, and Menards. All offer different types of Halloween. I'm excited to come in here. This store is the Cadillac of all Menards. Let's get into that Halloween spirit. By the way, it's also, as a recording of this, 11% rebate on everything. Even the cyber trucks are here to check out the 2024 all new Halloween at Menards. I haven't seen these pop up everywhere lately. A hole and created by Big Frankenstein right at the door. Look at the size of him. At a low price of $1.99. You know what? You add that 11% rebate. Wow. I mean, what would you do with him? Let's call this the Cadillac of Menards. They do have an elevator because there is a complete second story in this entire store. A lot to check out, even escalators for your carts going up and down. Yeah, some of the the yard decor. We have a clown right over here, kind of going through our own. And he step off the walk. The little Halloween atmosphere already. Look at the shoes on this clown. $2.29. I can't get him to work. What a creepy looking clown. Stepped on this a couple of times, just nothing happening. We'll keep on moving. Yeah, it looks like these two ladies are kind of greeting everybody with some machetes. Looks like they've been through already a couple of bodies, eh? $149.99. The Three Foot Sinister Sisters. Oh, they kind of alternate here. Directing us the paint, the tools, lumber, flooring, garden center, the grills, and couple of, uh, look at this witch kind of staring right through us. Look the size of skeleton. Ah, yes. I see another pine-sized human approaches. Oh, dear. What a splendidly terrible vision you are. <laughs> well, I like the angel kind of in the middle here of, of the witch. And then a skeleton on a one-wheel bike. $79.99, just kind of painting out, reaching out, saying, you know, room for two. Looks like you only got one seat, sir. And the three foot animated creepy doll, and they're not kidding. This is a very creepy doll. Oh, happy Halloween to you, miss. Let's see if she does anything here, please. Oh, He's moving now too, so I, yeah, I don't know what's happening with the clown down here, but we got some movement from old S Scully here, and the witch seems pretty nice. Yeah, she's just she's greeting everybody, saying hi. I missed the Halloween animated spooky tree, one seventy nine ninety nine. Boy. Christmas or Halloween, these uh, trees are pricey. Just beyond where all the patio furniture is, 11%. You know, this is the time that they're probably gonna really push in the next week, this weekend, clear out everything as they go from one season to another and everything Halloween that's left will be over here. Kinda got a taste of it going through that walkway. That little town here.
Oh, look at the greenhouse. We have the little shop of horrors, a gentleman pushing a couple. It's like they're making you know, some pumpkin pies. I thought they were pancakes. Yeah, there's, uh, there's the pies going down the track. The conveyor. A gentleman holding some, it's like some hay for his, his cow or a goat. Get the mummies in the pyramid. Fun house. Oh, look at the bat up here. And the train. Oh, that's good. Oh, we, we just activated, uh, it's like the Grim Reaper up here. Yeah, this, this guy just will, will crawl right off the, uh, the shelf. If you're looking for a Fox door stopper, this is, you can tell, very heavy. Will do the trick, no doubt. You know those strong winds in fall. Only $2.99. Giant skeletons. Oh, they light up too. Oh, that's cool. Look at that. Boy, are these witches kind of creepy. Just moving them around. We're trying to find the one that will work. Reach back here a little further. Well, it looks like none of them are, uh, are gonna come on. Nope. Just have to go for the, uh, just the creepy look. Yeah, she's like getting really close to me. Oh, I'm just jumping right to Thanksgiving. Look at this. I gotta get ready to catch him. Kittens for sale. The animated walking hand, spooky fun. I was hoping the hand would be on display, maybe around the corner, but. $29.99 inside the box. This would be cool to have. Yeah, he probably stands in one place and just, just kind of wiggles the, the fingers around. That's cool. And everything's just triggering him if we just walk by. I guess he's might be on the, uh, oh yeah, he's, he is on the toilet, isn't he? Who knew? Some of the displays we walked past, the skeleton on a bike, the uh, sinister sisters, the creepy doll, get misting skull. Oh, the giant skeleton. Now you could just set him right in the yard. Look at this. This takes up the entire shelf. $199.99. Seven and a half feet wide, two feet, 11 inches deep. Four feet high. Yeah, a stack of skeleton skulls here. Ooh, the eyes light up. 
R.I.P. Tombstone, a couple of skeletons, looks like a rat, spider on the top, 5617. And just keep in mind that if you're interested in any of the decorations, it's all 11% rebate, so you mail that in and you get more points, kind of like Kohl's Cash, coming back and using on future purchases. It's like some battery operated witch lantern. We have a bat, an alien, put a candle inside. Kind of the, the basics over here, some pumpkin stack. Ooh, look at that. It's nice when the displays work. So I have some skeletons here, looks like a, a crow on the top. Oh, I like that. There's skeleton over here. Yeah, it just resembles having like a candle inside. Jack-o-lantern with bats cut out. Witch hat, the flight night. Get that lit up. Happy Halloween at Min Arts. Got all the, the themed candle holders here with pumpkin, Frankenstein, a witch, a skeleton. And the spider in the in the spider web. Also a skeleton pineapple. Switch was right underneath the bottom, kinda just kinda goes different colors. That's pretty cool. But it will leave your fingers glittery if you, if you grab the uh, the top here. Yeah, we got uh, we got a souvenir. Skeletons, maybe maybe the beetles, you know if we got four of them. And an arm and arm here. And then another skeleton, looks like his eyes are gonna light up. So switch on the bottom. Oh yeah, there we go, it's like little flashlights. Look at these Halloween photo frames. Kinda like the Haunted Mansion walking through. Yeah, creepy. Not too bad, $8.99. Simple skeleton yard stake. Look pretty good. I have to plug in anything. Our batteries just, just kind of leave them by your front door. And the tree moves. Okay, so you know we saw this was about $179. So it just doesn't light up. It actually just kind of has a, a mind of its own, doesn't it? Okay. Yeah, that's good. Eight foot animated alien, two forty nine ninety nine. Welcome. We have crossed the great abyss to find you. Do not be afraid. We have some sights to show. So the tree is kind of motion censored, so I just I just kind of stepped from the alien to the tree and it just kind of went off on its own. We'll see if the Sinister Sisters... Okay, so they're working a little bit better over here than, than the original ones we saw. And nice having that tree in the background. Ecto-1 and Slimer, we have the Grim Reaper on a motorcycle, a ghost coming from the grave, a trick-or-treat witch with a ghost, gargoyle, dog going towards, it looks like a, a skeleton, is that a fire hydrant? We have the villains of Disney, Scoo, Stitch, man this would be cool in the front yard. Which means that it's nearly time for another harvest. <laughs> <laughs> It's the bad seed. Gotta watch those seeds we're planting and we'll end up with a very upset pumpkin. Clown we saw when we walked in. Get eight and a half feet tall, $329. Do have a demo of Scoob, a dog by the the skeleton fire hydrant. And a skeleton riding, it looks like a whale. Eight foot inflatable pirate and shark. Okay, it's a shark, a pirate skeleton, and a skeleton shark.
giant witch, 10 feet tall, all in this box. I always say, I always use that excuse, like, where are you going to store this stuff? Well, if it can fit in the box, I guess, you know, you can store it somewhere. It's not like you have to leave it set up year-round. Of course, you could. So some kind of a harvest look, the fall scarecrows, the Disney villains. Jack Skeleton, and some skeletons. Look at his eyes. <laughs> Donkey skeletons, $14.99. With a duck skeleton, I gotta admit, I haven't seen too many Duck skeletons in my life, six ninety nine. Sitting cat skeleton. You have another oh, dog skeleton with bones. So yeah, have, very interesting seeing uh, the skeleton eating a bone. It's like some dinosaur skeletons here, a snake skeleton, an old fish. Might be a piranha. All LED lights over here. Imagine the, the Christmas lights will probably be in the same spot after they go from one season to the next. You have the, the bat, kind of a plant, skeleton, another plant, the cat, and then they're right down here. Skeleton $49.99, the cat $39.99 along with the bat, and they have a spider too. Now this is good, black cat trunk or treat decorating kit. Look at this. Have a perfect Halloween. You know, this tree's kind of growing on me. It's kind of knocking the price when I first saw it, but I didn't know it moved and it made sounds. Pretty cool. Get a little close to the, uh, the Sinister Sisters over here. Watch how close I get to those. What do you think? I, I like this skeleton. He is huge. This would be a good prop for the yard. Some more inflatables over here. We have a four foot inflatable alien. Some more pumpkins. Pumpkin patch, $39.99. Let's see a friendly witch. Inflatable ghost. And a cat with happy Halloween. I was kind of hoping to see more of the inflatables. Now we have a train. We saw big Frankenstein, 20 feet tall. Like that Frankenstein we saw walking in the front door is all stuffed in this small, looks like a 20 by 20 box. Holy cow. A little walk through here. And the inflatable pumpkin reaper. I saw him at another store. I was kind of hoping he'd be out today. Five nights at Freddy's, lights up. Osculating head. You have Bonnie. Freddy and Foxy, all priced at $79.99. Five foot LED skeleton, $26.96. Yep. He's not lighting up. Let's see if any of these are gonna work. You might have to take these out. I don't really wanna mess with that. We're just doing the demos, but I imagine having to pull those out, but it'd be cool to see your eyes lighting up. Beware of Little Monsters, $14.99. These are the best, you know, they just, just simple signs you can stick out, come in, my pretties, and the, the happy Halloween gnome, the, the pumpkin with the skeleton. I need one of these.
know the witch is still greeting everybody. Kind of sneak up on her from the back. Say goodbye to everybody we saw when we got here. See you later, creepy doll. Thanks for the scares. We'll see you later, sir. Great balancing act on that bike. Yeah, not as exciting as the other tree. He, he moved around, so these these are set up a little bit different. Can't really get them to go, kind of go on their own. So it's the best we can do. Sinister Sisters, we saw a good amount of them tonight. But yeah, these it's not working. I guess there's no sound. I think the the ones on the shelf had the sound. So just working a little bit different. And unfortunately, we couldn't get this big, giant, creepy clown. To do much except kind of scare us, especially with those Ronald McDonald feet. And they have instructions on how to prepare to exit the walkway. The oh, there's. So I just saw the skeleton moving over there. We, we just missed him. The escalator coming down. The walkway will soon be ending. Please be cautious as you exit. Not only do they have a Mickey Mouse Pez, but check it out—they have a taco. I mean, it is hard to believe that this 20-foot Frankenstein was in roughly a 20 by 20 box. Might have even been smaller than that. I mean, look at this. What a mammoth. Oh, we got the seagulls. That's going to do it for today. I want to thank everybody for coming out. Checking out Halloween at Menards with me. We'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. I apologize, we have a bunch of unboxing, a bunch of stuff that I just had not gotten around to. Halloween kinda, kinda took over this week. You know, I, I guess Monday I had expectations and I tried to correct it the other day and then today at Menards. But I do have one unbox that I kinda broke my own rule on ordering instead of trying to find in store because you know, it kind of takes the fun out of it. Even though one of these is available in store, the other one I just could not find. So I decided to be able to complete the set. Just one-handed. I was going to have to order. You can guess. There's two figures in here. Which ones they are. Because we needed to make this guy right here lock up. If you remember, he was on a episode of Batman the Animated Series. So at least Target sent everything in this box, Lokes. We need four characters and this right here is the reason why I ordered because I could not find the Riddler anywhere. I saw him earlier but I just didn't think that I was gonna start collecting these and yeah it just kinda took off. We have the Riddler and Commissioner Gordon. Loki is right on the edge right here. So we can make lockup. All four characters. We picked up, I don't like this. So they put a, a tracking. I'm gonna open these up regardless, but we were able to pick up the Joker and the Batman that's showing up here is the evil Batman. He has the, look at this. He has the red eyes. Okay. And uh, that's, so we have two Batmans. Excited to do this. I think tomorrow we will put together either the condiment cane or lockup. We're going to do an unboxing, open these up. We're doing another unboxing right now. Who do we have in here? We have Loki. 